attention to the second men's doubles semi-final of the day. And as with the first semi-final, it's a Malaysian pair against an Indonesian pair. It is On Yu Singh and Tio Yi Yi, the number eight seeds and World Championship bronze medalists from last year, up against the uh, two-time World Championship bronze medalists, Alfian and Ardianto of Indonesia. When we look at the men's doubles draw, it was the only discipline with no withdrawals. So that was a very good thing. We were down to five seeds by the quarterfinal stage, as you can see, and only four different nationalities, which means that along with the women's singles, the least diverse of all disciplines. Four seeds, though, through to the semi-final stage, but only two different nationalities, uh, because as you can see, and as I've just said, two Malaysian pairs and two Indonesian pairs. Gideon and Sokomolio, if you were with us earlier, you would have seen them beat the world champions and they're through to their fourth final here at the Denmark Open, the two-time former champions, Gideon and Sokomolio. But who will join them tomorrow? Uh, will it be a eighth final of the year for Alfian and Ardianto? Or will it be the number eight seeds, Hong Yu Sin and Tiu? Presenting from Malaysia, on using TOE. The 2021 World Championship bronze medalists, the number eight seeds here in Odense. On Yu Sin and Tio Yi Yi. Making their fourth yeah, appearance at Brown this particular Indonesia. event. Brown and Alfian it's their most successful Alfian. year, their first Alfian. ever semi final year. Their opponents, Fajar Alfian and Mohamed Darian Adianto, making their third appearance here at the Denmark Open, their previous two meet trips here to Odense. They lost in the quarter-final stage. And they lost last year in the quarter-final stage to another Malaysian pair, Fosi Fei and Noor Izzedin. So a first ever semi-final at this event for Alfian and Ardianto. But this will be an eighth meeting between these two pairs and of the previous seven, Alfian and Ardianto have won five of them. Come here for the toss. Two, black or red? Black, red for you. It's black. Who will serve? Two will serve. So the Malaysians have won the toss of the coin and this chosen side. to serve. Who will receive? Ardianto. So the players will need to change ends before the start of play. Now, just to recap on those head-to-heads, in fact, Alfian and Ardianto didn't just win the last occasion, which was the quarter-final of the Malaysian Super 750 event earlier this year. They've actually won the last three encounters. So the Malaysians have got their work cut out here to avoid it being an all-Indonesian men's doubles final. considering Indonesian men's doubles pairs in world terms are dominant. I think it'd be a fair reflection. They've got three pairs currently in the top six in the world ranking. On Yu Singh, as you can see, is 27 years of age from the ancient city of Malacca. Tall Lassie, 182, that's five foot 11 and a half. And his partner, Tio Yi, is 29 years of age from Muak in Johor. And they're playing off their career high of nine. In fact, it's an eighth consecutive week at their career high of nine. Number five on the race to the World Tour Finals. And when we look at their matches so far, well, in the first round, they beat the winners of the Japan Open 750, Liang and Wang from China. More Chinese opposition in the second round against the winners of the Indonesian Super 1000, Liu and Wu. And in the quarterfinal, needed three games against the Olympic champion Li Yang with a new partner, Lu Chen. Fajar Alfian, 
is 27 years of age from Bangdong in West Java. Number six on the world rankings, and that, as I was telling you just now, is the third Indonesian pair on the current world rankings. Have spent a total of 38 weeks as number five in the world, so they're one place down from their career high. Three different spells. Ready and Mohamed Rian Ardianto, 26 years of age. They went to three games in their first match against Yula and Van der Lek. Uh, then beat Choi and Kim from Korea, two straight games, quarter-final against the left and right-handed pair from Chinese Taipei, Lu Ching Yao and Yang Po Han. Well, Henrik Boas of Denmark is our umpire for this one. And our service judge, Rem Van Eyck of the Netherlands. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Tiu Yi Yi and Ong Yu Sin, Malaysia. And on my left, Fajar Alvian, Mohamed Rian Adriandro, Indonesia. Tiu Yi Yi to serve to Mohamed Rian Adriandro. Love all. Play. So the second of the men's double semi-finals gets underway. Who's going to join the two-time former champions Gideon and Sukumolio in the final? Well, there is no doubt whatsoever that Alfian and Ardianto are the most One. consistent pair on the world tour this year. Seven finals from 13 tournaments. That's over 50%, over 50% of One finals more. reached in tournaments played so far. Nice drop, that's going wide. And in contrast, On Yu Sin and Tiu Yi Yi are looking to reach a first final in 32 months since winning the 2020 Thailand Masters 300 event in January of that year. Good touch from Alfian. Two all. Now oh, that really is delightful. He apologises for the good fortune. Whoa! That's over. Three, two. Yeah, good smash from Ardianto. Three all. Oh, what a block. That is lovely. Forehand block from Onyu Sin. Take a look at this. Just guides it across court. Look at that. That's not only the technical ability to play that block, it's the awareness and the vision to know where the gap is.
missed it. Serves over. Five, four. It's over five oh. Glimpse of Chinny Wee, the Malaysian's Aye. coach, the Malaysian's independent players. Service over six five. Team up world number one women's doubles. Where Chinny Wee to be their coach. Seven, five. Oh, oh. Oh. Eight, yeah, it's five. Eight. Serves that. Come on, you sing. Oh. Just watch how it dips. Yeah, as soon as it's crossed the net, it's dipping down. Had a second go at it. Yeah. Shuttle deflected by the net cord and it gave Teal time to have a second go, having missed it on the overhead. It's gone long. Well, Two challenge here from Teal. I think out. he might well lose this challenge. Had a quick glimpse there of his body art on his left forearm. Teal's got believe. Well, I never believed that that was going challenge to land Challenge unsuccessful. In. Oh, One it's a wasted challenge, challenge. Remaining. Seven, yeah, eight. Clearly, clearly long. Play. One, two. Eight, oh. Well, they've closed the three-point deficit. Nine, eight. Of course, very disappointing for the home fans that there's no home players involved on semi-finals day here at the Denmark Open. I've been trying to search through the records. Oh, oh. Of course, this tournament dates back to the early 1930s. And I don't believe that a, that has ever happened previously. In 70 previous Nine, Denmark oh. Opens, I think there's always been a home player involved on semi-final oh. Saturday. And that is a worrying thing as far as Denmark, Danish Babington is concerned. Nice drop. Brilliant play. From Alfian. Ten. Nine. Yeah, it was the drop shot that did the damage. Ten, nine. Oh. 
serves over. Yeah. Didn't gain any advantage with the flick serve. Yeah. That's let it play hey, from hey. Onu Singh. So who's going to have the advantage at the mid game interval? The answer is the Malaysians. Tight opening game so far. Good choice of huh? the smash across the body of Ardi Anto. Also weak reply. Twenty seconds. Play. Oh, hey. Hey, hey. Hey. Oh, yes. Once again, very good placement 11. of the smash from Alfian. Look, he jumped from the base position in the centre of the court to play that round the head smash. Over twelve, eleven. Hey, hey, hey. Serves over twelve, oh. Twelve. Yeah, that's an issue. Fourteen. The drift. Seem to have upped the tempo a little bit to me. 15, 12. Four straight points. Off the top of the tape and went over. 16 12. From Ardi Anto. Look at that. Nothing you can do about that. Two. Okay. Two. Is it okay? Thank you. Five straight points now to the number five seeds, Alfian and Ardi Anto. 16. 
17, 12. Over. Broke the strings with that shot. 13. Adi Anto. Well, that had been a run of six straight points, and I wonder if that's the decisive move in this opening game by the Indonesians. Over. And now he's broken another string. 18, 13. Oi! Over. 14, 18. Hey, hey. Serves over 19, 14. Lost a bit of rhythm at the moment. This match. Oh, that's a great Over. shot. Lovely play from Teal. 15, e. 19. Push down the forehand side, then whipping the shuttle immediately across to the backhand side and finding a big gap. Nice. And a nice way to bring 20, up game, game point, point opportunities. 15. Lovely disguise drop from Adi Anto. Subs over. Well, 16, mind judge indicating out, but uh, hey, hey. it touched the shuttle. Adianto, yeah, clearly see him touching the shot there. And it was called by the umpire straight away. Good umpiring. Okay. Opening game to the number five seeds, Fajar Alfian and Mohamed Durian Adianto. First game won by Fajar Alfian and Mohamed Durian Adianto, 21-16. 21-16 confirms our umpire. Beautiful little block to finish the rally. Look how the rotational play. One's pulled out of position at the net. The other one covers the other side. 21-16 minutes. Sekali tabuk silang, Jom. Tos, tadi kan kena tuh. Silang situ, ya. Manjangin terus. Kalau lu selfie sama asiknya, oh. Masih nyodok, kalau kan separuh. Tungguin aja. Yang belakang depan tuh depannya aja. Tapi kalau bisa ambil, ambil. Yang belakang sih, ambil belakang aja. Kayak tadi tuh, sodok silang atau lurus, ya. Tapi kalau 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 sih, oh. Dia tetap kiri kan, nah, gue selfie kecil. Dia pasti netting. Geser dikit, oh kan ya. Geser dikit aja, jangan jangan angkat. Kalau angkat sama sini. Dia dia kanannya bagus. Dia dua-duanya jom, tekanan bagus. Nah, kalau sekali-sekali sama Theo mau ngelop juga, tapi kan sini menang angin, agak mundur dikit, pelanin dikit, ya. Satu, kedua. Kedua pembukanya, kedua-duanya kemana? Ke kiri. Dia serpik, gesernya ke kiri sini, nggak enak. Kalau kanannya dia bagus, ya. Jom, belakang kanan, jangan lurus, sini nabuk. Sini bagus. Buang aja ke silang, ke tengah, ke tengah, silang, sini boleh, oke? Kalau tadi itu pasti om, kenapa? Coba bisa temennya. Kabar dulu dia dia pasti angkat terus tuh. Iya, iya, iya. Kalau angin dia pasti angkat terus tuh. Nembak. Kabar dulu kabar dulu. Ceplik asal turun aja dulu. Jangan tembak terus tembak. Cop lagi, ceplik lagi. Twenty seconds. Ada kenanya. Twenty seconds. Eh, startnya jangan kendor semua. Cepat, cepat, cepat.
So one game away, Alfie and Ardiento from an incredible eighth World Play. Tour oh, final oh, oh. of the year. What have the Malaysians got in response? Serves over. One love. That was a flatter smash. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, good shot. So. Two, love. Oh, behind the back. Oh, that's nice. Calmly played into the open space by Mohamed Orian Adianto. There was the behind the back shot from Tio. Watch this final oh. delightful shot. Great awareness again of where the gap was. Serves over three, one. Serves over two, three. Always push that long with the back line. Service over. Needs to think about the drift. Four, two. I think those little pushes they played oh. into the mid-court oh. area, especially when they played it with angle, I think they should be trying to do more of that. Alfie and Adianto. Service over. Three, four. Oh. Uh, Tio just turning to his partner and his coach as if to say should I have left that one at the back of the court it was earlier than that where he had hesitation and doubt for all five four Indonesian coaches. So serves over five all.
that was an unbelievable drop shot from Hardy Entrell. Oh. Uh, good rally. One of our longer rallies of the match, I suspect. Six, five. Yeah, shuttle got deflected off the top of the tape. That's why Alfian missed that one. It is indeed the longest rally. I thought it was. Oh. Hey. 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 Oh. Seven, five. Serves over six, seven. Oh. Oh. Serves over oh. eight, six. Seven, eight. Play on. Yeah, good rotational play from the Indonesians. The Indonesians need to get themselves on the attack at some point. Well, they may have won that rally, but I don't see the Malaysians winning the entirety of this semi-final just by defending. This one from Ardiento into the net. Nine, eight. Oh. Yeah, rallies are getting longer oh. and longer. Oh. Oh. Ten, eight. A poor 11, miss eight, from interval. Ardianto. It was a loose serve, and it should have been severely punished. Instead of which, he hit wide. 11-8. The Malaysians lead here mid-game interval of the second game. Di ada cepiknya juga Jom, jangan keras 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 cop. Cepiknya juga ada ke dadanya kemana ke dadanya. Ya. Kalau masih sekali, kena aja. Twenty 
Jar, depannya lebih berani lagi naro ngadu-ngadu nyodok-nyodok dorong-dorong. 11 8 Play. Hey, hey, hey. So can the Malaysians push home? Oh. 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 Certainly a, a four point lead now. There's a handsome advantage. Yeah, just enough pace on that from Ong Yu Sin. Get it past Alfian at the net. Said they needed to get on the attack. Malaysians. Well, this shuttle has obviously slowed considerably because nobody's getting any advantage with the attacking play. Nice drop. Well, this has got to be the longest rally of the match so far. And by some considerable margin. Uh, I don't like it when men's doubles is reduced to a, a clearing game because the shuttles are too slow. Yeah, it was the drop shot from Tui Yi that did the damage. And no wonder they're changing the shuttle. And that must have fluffed up the feathers, 13. which slows the shuttle Eight. down. Yeah, uh, a nice finish from Ong Sin. Uh, look, it was pedestrian pace earlier in the rally. Thirteen. Eight. <laughs> Ninety-one shots. More than twice as many as the previous longest rally, which was 43. <laughs> Well, from eight all to thirteen eight for the Malaysians. Well, so nine thirteen. I wonder if that's too big a margin. 10, 13. The Indonesians to catch back up. I'm not sure it is. So the Malaysians, in my opinion, perhaps need to keep with that same tactic of looking to be positive. Hey, hey, hey. Shuttle changed again. It seems that these shuttles are fluffing up with every long rally. Oh, tumble serve. Oh, it was a good tumble serve too. I they couldn't convert.
open wide. Oh, my goodness, he took it. Yeah, very, very good work by the Malaysians. Super rally. 15, 11. Yeah. If the shuttles are slow, then you've got to work to get the front court player involved. The only way you're going to win the rally is by interceptions and from the front of the court when the shuttles are slow. Sixteen, eleven. Wipe the court, please. Wipe the court, please. Wipe the court, please. Avian, please wear to. Show where to wipe. Frank in the middle. yes. Yeah, middle in. Thank you. You should fit. Foot. So I think 16, uh, the Indonesians are 11. almost at a stage of now or never if they want to come back and win this in two straight games. Oh, beautiful, beautiful drop. From Fajar Alfian. 12-16. Look at that. Outright winner, right in between the two Malaysians, both going for it, then both leaving it to the other. Maintaining their five point advantage. That's oh, another good over. serve, but an even 13. better return. Is fine there. Too easy. Well, maybe it was just too awkward for him. It didn't really seem committed to the shot. Look where he's playing that smash from. Ooh, got in each other's way. Yeah. Intense rally. 17. So now it's really believable again for the Indonesians. Thank you. Five point advantage seems quite a mountain to climb. Now just two points in it. 15. 17. Logically, this is play seems such so much easier for the Indonesians. Just two points, make that one point in it. 
from Alfie Good rally. Huge point too. Crucial. Yeah. Seventeen. Oh. Now, this is turning into a real battle here in the second game. Who's got the courage? No! Yes. Well, the answer in that rally was for Jean Alfian. Really 19, intercepting so 18. well, too. Then the push, three. Another interception, four. End of rally. That is wonderful play from Alfian. of the last eight points to the Indonesians. going to be a game point or a match point. This rally will decide that. Good interceptions again from Fajar Alfian. Really making the difference. I was saying early on, you have to work 20, to get the net player involved. 19. It's from the net where you can expect to hit winners, not from the back of the court. And that great interception once again from Alfian doing precisely that. It's a match point opportunity for Alfian and Ardianto. It's gone long. Over. Match point saved by the Malaysians. 20 oh. <laughs> oh, it wasn't the best of serves. It was a little bit loose from on you, Sin. And now a second match point opportunity. Okay. 
for Alfian and Ardiento. Oh no, didn't quite catch what the umpire was saying there. Point number two. Oh, that was going wide, but he took it and played the winner. And Alfian was absolutely outstanding at the crucial moments in that semi final. Through to an eighth World Tour Tournament final of the year. And that's lovely sportsmanship. Great respect between the two players, pairs. 44 minutes for the victory. And when you consider that they had been 12 17 down in the second game, that is a remarkable comeback by Alfian and Ardiento. No wonder big smiles from them. Max. It will be an all-Indonesian men's doubles Mohamed final Bian. tomorrow Adrian because the number two 16, seeds 22, and two-time former champions Gideon and Sukamolio await. And it will be the second time in three years that we've had an all-Indonesian men's doubles final here at the Denmark Open. Delightful Alfian and Ardianto, and rightly so. Yeah, isn't that nice? Sportsmanship is alive and well in the sport of badminton. 21 16, 22 20 in a match lasting 44 minutes. Welcome back to semi-final Saturday here in Odense at the Denmark Open, presented by Victor. Well, our eighth match of the day is the second of the women's singles semi-finals, and it's an all-Chinese affair. It is the two-time world championship bronze medalist, Turbing Xiao, the left-hander and number eight seed, up against the unseeded Han 